What's up you guys, it's Ashley and I'm back with another video. Today's video I'm going to be retwisting my hair for the first time since getting crochet maintenance done. This is about three weeks after getting crochet maintenance done. I'm using my favorite gel, Supergo Hair Gel. I get it from Amazon. This has been the only gel so far that can tame my new growth and it keeps my locks looking retwisted even two weeks after retwisting my hair. There's a lot of new growth at my roots, but the difference this time is that all of my new growth is in its place in its own lock. Rather than before getting crochet maintenance done, all of my new growth was kind of all over the place. There's another video on my channel that explains in detail how I retwist my hair, so I'll link that in the description box below and put it in the iCard. The biggest differences in retwisting my hair this time versus retwisting my hair before crochet maintenance is that there was less shedding, it took less time, my locks are noticeably longer, heavier, and thicker, and I didn't have to snap my roots to part my locks with my tail comb. Usually when I retwist my hair, because there's so much new growth at my roots and they're all kind of not in a lock, I end up having to comb stuff out or using a tail comb to repart my hair. Whereas now that I've gotten crochet maintenance done, my loctician was able to repart my hair and use the crochet needle to put everything back in its place. I mentioned this in my crochet maintenance video, but if you have problems where your roots of your hair are breaking or maybe they're separating from their lock, um, I definitely recommend crochet maintenance because it was able to help me tremendously. Crochet maintenance is something that I would probably consider getting every six months, but at the same time I want to learn how to do it for myself because it will save me time and money. <laughs> I feel like now that I'm able to retwist my locks and all of my hairs are in its place, I can see my true length of my locks. Even in these past three weeks, I can feel that my hair is longer and thicker. Usually it would take 45 to 50 minutes. This time it took 40 minutes because I took breaks to eat snacks, but. <laughs> um, it also took less time to dry my hair this time. Usually it would take 50 minutes and I do not like using heat on my hair for that long. So this time I tried something different and sat under the dryer on medium heat for 25 minutes and then an extra 10 minutes with cold air. Six months ago, my locks were just past shoulder length and now they are closer to bra strap length. I'll be doing a length check video soon, but I definitely see where there's growth.
so this is the morning after retwisting my hair i had to throw my hair in a messy bun to go work out can you tell i just woke up <laughs> As always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. 